got the live scope going. Holy crap. It's three feet down? To the to the roof of the truck. <laughs> I'm off the truck. This thing might have been dumped before he's even born. Possibly. Look at you. Since birth, he was destined to pull this car out. We pulled a car out of the lake and we wanted to report it. What's going on with this one? Not good question. Not, we don't have. I was hoping y'all could tell us. You mind if I see your license one more time? He said it returned weird. It showed you have a female for some reason in the system. Uh -oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You got something to say? <laughs> well, <laughs> something I need to talk to you about. Man. <laughs> if you guys want to see how we got this truck out of the water, make sure to subscribe and keep on watching. I'm Adam Brown. And I'm Jeremy, AKA Nug. We search the rivers and lakes across America for wrecked vehicles underwater. You wouldn't know it by just looking, but there's thousands out there, and everyone tells a story. Insurance fraud, stolen, accidents. It's our mission to search for the missing, find vehicles, and remove them from harming our environment. This is Wrecked and Recovered. Uh, wrong number. I was calling in regards to the property. Wrong, wrong number. Wrong number. Man, dude, I just I keep getting these freaking spammy calls. Is that just me? But am I special? Well, I mean, I get them too, <laughs> but you're you're not Terry. I'm not Terry. That I guy has a wrong number, and he still tried to sell it. <laughs> I was like, I, I kept telling him. He's like, oh, so this isn't Terry, but hey, I got a timeshare. <laughs> I just I just want to think I'm special though. What if yeah. you? I mean, if you're if you're lonely, maybe it's nice to get a spam call. So we are back here in Georgia, eh? Yeah, yeah. We're not that far from my house. I'm kind of excited about that. We're not far. I tell you what, we almost didn't make it today. I mean, I was fine. The universe was telling telling us almost that we shouldn't come today. Man, what is that? That's more spam. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to make a video here and your phone will be quiet. Oh, God. Yeah, dude, the tow truck broke down last night on the way here and uh, the turbo went poof. I had to fix that. Now I'm not gonna lie, I, I did a lot of work in my house, so I was really tired. Oh yeah. So when you said the tow truck broke down, I was like, oh. But on the inside, I'm like, oh, I get to go to sleep. <laughs> well, as you can see, we're driving. Uh, yeah, you fixed it. I, I, I mean, I, I reclamped the turbo. <laughs> well, it was an easy fix. I'll tell you what, you kind of need a turbo to drive uh, a truck like when this. When I googled that, it said, don't drive only if you have to, because engine failure is not it, far behind. No. So I'm like, oh, that's not good. <laughs> I mean, as far as I'm concerned, this truck is kind of a ticking time bomb. Rusty old girl. I replaced four of the hydraulic lines, so we'll see how long how those last. How long have this thing now? Uh, it doesn't feel like that long. But not a year yet. Not a year. Man, I mean, what, it's pulled out nine cars so far? Today will be 10? Today is number 10, man. Man, and luckily, I think today's going to be pretty easy. I, th I think and I hope we'll just I think we're gonna run into drama. We might piss off some fishermen. We're gonna ruin their fishing hole. <laughs> Probably <laughs> that truck. That truck is like nobody's gonna catch anything once we pull that truck out. <laughs> but you know yeah. what? It's it's a what do you call it? A watershed like a reservoir. So I think this is drinking water. So technically we're 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 helping the community by getting. This yeah, out of their yeah. Water. I mean, it definitely doesn't belong there. All right, let's get in here. Let's get the boat in the water. Let's get this day going. Sounds good. So we're, we're in where? Com Commerce. Commerce, Georgia. Didn't most place exists. <laughs> I knew where it's Athens is, but you know. It's pretty close to I think people know Athens more so. I think it's cool that we Commerce. finally found another car in my state. Oh yeah? You know, because pickings are slim in Georgia. There's not many places to hide vehicles. But I guess there's lots of lakes. There's, there's lots so. of lakes. This is like a reservoir, I think it's considered. Um, yeah. But it's like the only thing with the boat ramp within like an hour. <laughs> I'm surprised there's not more out here. We should double check. <laughs> But we have ourselves a pickup. Did you find something online about there being a... Uh... A, a couple hours away, there's like a stolen pickup that kind of looks like it might be the shape of this one. So that's what we're gonna, that's what we're just gonna make believe this is the this is the truck. Sure, yeah. Dude, we're gonna have to drive through the grass. So we're not on a boat ramp today. Oh, well, get the, yeah. I mean, I can move, I'll move the van out of the way and then we'll just drive over here. It's kind of more Once we've I don't it. think it's rained. Well, it's a little muddy right here. That should be fun. Ah, we'll be it. We'll just, we'll just drive around that. I ain't scared. But so I guess that peninsula, it's right in this little cove. Yeah. And it seems like a lot of people are catching fish around this truck. So, uh, yeah, I'm yeah. sorry, fishermen. Yeah, what do you think? <laughs> boat in there. the water? Yeah, let's put the boat in. Mark this baby. And uh, <laughs> get going. I like it. Whoa.
All right, we got the boat in the water. Let me go over here and mark this thing. Juniper, getting all organized? I was trying to. How's it every time we get something, we end up filling it up with a bunch of crap? Can't just have a nice organized. We're, you know, we're basically hoarders. I guess. Oh, of scuba equipment. Actually, I think all scuba divers are hoarders. I think it's just all kinds of equipment. <laughs> now we got water hose stuff. And we got, oh my gosh, whatever. Whatever. Tommy's gonna be hot today. Well, you know, I didn't want to come, but uh. <laughs> yeah. Man. I think we should do a. No, we probably shouldn't. <laughs> I was gonna say, let's do a, let's do a poll. Who's hotter? Who's hotter? Somebody's feelings are getting hurt. <laughs> Adam, well, dude, I, I, mean, I don't like no old men. I'm taller, but you have a better beard, so I don't know. Well, that's just because you haven't groomed yours. I mean, if you Mine actually, just doesn't grow. I'm like Joe Dirt, man. Because you don't shave. I shave where it counts. <laughs> Your butt? Yeah. So we're looking. Let's see, I got the live scope going. Holy crap. It's so big. That's so much to do. The water is 67 degrees, man. It's pretty warm. All right, so I'm going to aim this. Literally over here. Dude, I mean, it's seven feet. We're looking three feet. We'll be able to stand on it. Oh, it's three feet down to the to the roof of the truck. <laughs> so, so I need to use a little bit less rope. Yeah, the highest there. point is three feet. Dude, we'll be able to swim up here and stand on the roof. So it's almost wheels. Definitely. The only question is, is it like semi new enough to pull out? Or now. is it an old, old frame? Well, as always, we use these big old magnet fishing magnets to hook Let's on the car. Let's go and see what happens. <laughs> but since it's three feet down. Uh, is that, is that it right there? Yeah. It's not sticking too well. Well, you're on the... But yeah, you're right. You can literally stand on this thing. I mean, see, right now you're on the... Wait, are you stuck on it? I'm, it's not sticking well, but it's right there. You're, you're, I think you're stuck on the, the, the bed. Is it an old wooden bed? <laughs> no. But yeah, I can see your, I think that's why I can see your magnets. Like, that's, yeah, that's it. You Man, your, be, your motor might hit this thing. My motor don't go three feet deep. It literally is three feet. Well, you, you can get out and stand on it. And I'll still be able to see your butt. It's just not sticking, but I guess you don't really need a good stick. No, just swim out here and you'll be able to feel it with your feet. Like, all right, well, that was easy. Um, this probably could be the easy, like one of the easiest ones we've done. <laughs> just for giggles, I'll put the uh, buoy on. Oh, well, I mean, that's <laughs> probably a smart idea. <laughs> facing. I don't know how we. All right. Here's the truck. That was easy. Well, since you're so tall, you want to dive it? <laughs> you just walk out of here to it. You don't even need to put your gear on, man. Let's go pull ourselves out of truck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> man what is the plan here all right man here's what i got i'm thinking we got a hundred feet of cable should reach pretty close to the water if not to the water right you with me you with me now we got a hundred foot of the rope the orange rope yep that's what you're gonna take with you down to the truck and some form or fashion of rigging it i don't know yet maybe j hook i don't know i mean it went straight in yeah yeah i mean it might be able to tie a knot i don't even know let's <laughs> you know, not get crazy but that's what we're planning here oh <gasps> got d-rings that's what you can do We'll just D-ring it. D-ring it? We'll just loopy and D-ringy. I think we could zip tie it, man. You got enough. <laughs> dude, that should be a video. How many zip ties can winch out a vehicle? That mean... That's a good video, that's dude. a lot of wasted plastic. If you guys want to... Well, in a controlled environment. In a control, in a if you guys, Leave a comment if you want to watch us pull out a car with zip ties. Neat. <laughs> Nobody can this, steal our idea. Let's see how far this goes. Yeah. Now everybody's gonna be like, dang, all Adam does is film. Like, I prefer the manual labor as long as you make the movie, man. <laughs> well, now you're on the last ring, but. Uh, yeah, maybe stop there. Good enough. Woo! Dude, it's getting so hot. This is how you, this is how you fish. It's already hot. That's how you fish? That's how you fish. You look like you had a whole day's work. We just started. I'm exactly 
I'm a shining definition example of what an out of shape middle-aged man looks like. <laughs> that just wore me out. Woo! Are you a boomer, Jeremy? <coughs> <laughs> no, what? I think that answers my question. <laughs> so next thing, I'm gonna go get suited up in my gear and uh, I'm probably gonna sweat to death. I'm not putting on my thermals though because it is too hot already. I say you shouldn't put on anything. <laughs> I'll just go in my birthday suit. Here you go. Happy birthday to y'all. <laughs> yeah. I'll throw that out just in case we use it. I'm actually gonna throw out a lot of things. What you got? Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah. There's a tank in here too. <laughs> Dude, this thing is like a magic hat. Just keep pulling stuff out. So I was just thinking, <laughs> ooh, what do we have here? <laughs> is that a bunny? Listen, I can push a lot in there. That's not a bunny. Oh, it's a rat. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's saying I lost my nerve. What are we talking about? Look at all this hard work I'm doing. Everybody uh, give us a rating on our organization. Don't do that. They're gonna be like, F, double F. <laughs> you guys are horrible. One day we'll put on that other new winch line. I think it's missing something. Yeah, it's somewhere in there. Man. All right, so I'm gonna have to confirm once I actually dive it, but this is the direction I think, and I think it just went straight in. So we're gonna go down and um, I'm gonna try not to have to hook it on the wheels because then it'll pull out a little sideways. Hopefully there's just like a, a, a hitch <laughs> what? <laughs> Hopefully there's a hitch or something like there and it's not too old of a truck where we can trust the bumper. The sonar is showing the wheels are pretty darn exposed. So you might be able to get around an axle too. if, if I mean, case. we can, but uh, I'll yell at you because it's only three feet. You just pop your head up and go, dude, <laughs> you're not going to believe this. Because I don't say dude enough. Man, dude. <laughs> <laughs> we already got the hundred foot cable laid out and made it all the way to the water. Now we got this hundred foot nylon rope that has proven itself worthy, because it ain't broke yet. So what I'm doing now is laying it out neatly for no reason, besides to look cool. And then you're gonna take this with you and figure out how to wrap around that truck. If we go pull it out. I don't wanna walk through that. Well, here's the thing, I was gonna lay, I was gonna lay down my coat like a gentleman, unless you walk over this, this water. Just carry me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry up, take your pants off. Dude, it's still wet from two weeks ago. That's probably bodily fluids. Snap them. <laughs> oh, I better take that uh, wedding ring off. <laughs> Wait, so you don't have a spare? No. Just put it in your pocket. It did fall in the toilet a few weeks ago, though. Oh, you had to go. I flushed it. Did you Did you go into the pee Let's water? Let's say I got it out. Ah. Uh, just went for it. Just pushed the Snickers bar to the side. It's more like a series of Tootsie Rolls. Looks like a family of deer came through my bathroom. It's like, God, do you have a goat? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, you know what time it is. Do it, do it, do it. No. Make the noise. Everybody wants to see it. Nobody wants to see the noise. I don't want to hear it. Let's hear it. Oh no. Do it, do it. Pick your head up, open your mouth. The deer's not going. Do it. Do it, do it, do it. <laughs> it did it. Oh my gosh! I love it every day that I get to see that. <laughs> I think it's like a uh, 2000s, maybe 90s. I think it's a Chevy 1500. Yep. It's a full size. I don't know. I could be wrong, it might be a Datsun. <laughs> so pretty much, I guess, taking the uh, the GoPro down there is pretty much so you can scream at the camera. Because <laughs> I appreciate you able to see anything. It's for the... Uh, it's for the effect. For the effect, yeah. Look how challenging this is. But up top and be like, I can see your head. <laughs> Most of the time, the GoPro is going to be out of the water. <laughs> yeah, probably. Like, oh look, I can see his GoPro. It's like a periscope. Wow. All right, got all my gear on, looking like a penguin. This should be uh, pretty quick. Feels so much better in this water. It's actually a little chilly. Give me, give me a look here. It's just a, yeah, it's definitely a leaf. 
Let's hope you're not allergic. You'll come out all swollen up. <laughs> Something wrong with my face. I can't see nothing. All right. Do you need me to go this way? Oh, 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 go, oh, no. <laughs> Man, he's halfway there and he's not even up to his butt yet. <laughs> This is gonna take very long. I guess he's probably gonna be clearing the vehicle right now. Seeing if any of the windows are down, all that stuff. Looking for a tag. I think he's just gonna rig it while he's out there. He's got a J hook, so he's just gonna hook it up on something. And we'll pull it out and see what happens. It's not hooked on it. The magnet's not on. No. It's right here somewhere. Is it farther out? Yeah, it's over here. Like right there? Like if I keep going straight, I'll hit it. I'm at the truck. Oh, I can't see much. The truck's pretty old. It's really old. Really rusty. It's it's been in down there a long time. I don't even think the roof's there. Crumbling. Ah, uh, we pulled a Volvo out. We can do this. Where'd you get it on an axle? It, yeah, it's somewhere on the rear left tire. That should come out. So is it facing? Yeah, the rear is facing. It, it went straight in. It's probably been in there for 20 years. Yeah, let's pull it out. See what happens. Better than oh. 40 years. Ain't the oldest one we've done. Hey guys, we're cutting in really quick to this episode just to do a little bit of self-promotion because we don't have any sponsors for Wrecked and Recovered right now. So we're sponsoring ourselves. We get tons of views on these videos, right? People are loving this channel, they're loving these videos, but you know what they're not doing? They're not hitting that sub button. So that is what you guys need to do right now. Hit that sub button, hit that follow button, whatever button there is, hit it. Right except now. The, except the thumbs down button. Don't also... <laughs> Also, if you want to get, uh, if you want to help support us more, you can go to rectumrecovered.com and you can get some cool hats like this. I'm not wearing I got a Rectum Recovered t-shirt, but... Uh, oh, I don't even have one on. Never mind. You can get one of these too, but I don't think it's on the channel. We have shirts, we have hats like this. So rectumrecovered.com and subscribe, like this video, and let's jump back into the episode. Let's go! All right, that was uh, fun. We could not find that truck to save her. my life. Okay, our lives. You! I, I didn't even have it hooked on the magnet. I you just you. believed me. I thought you did. It looked like you did. He's close. It looked like it did. Man, you see that sonar show underwater. I'm not, th this truck is not going to be very exciting. I don't. I don't think there's a play. I don't know. Man, I couldn't really see. It's a pretty old truck. You should be yeah, like. I don't think I there's much of a cab left. I am so excited about this truck. That's what I want to hear. From I am so excited. I can't wait to see what kind of goodies is inside this truck. That's well, only see. one way to find out. Uh -huh. You ready? Ready to get loud? Oh yeah. And we just replaced all the uh, winch hydraulic lines. Shout out to Rick. Put in there. <laughs> Shout out to Rick. 
What you want me to do? Tighten it up. Oh. No, 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 the lever, man, pull the lever. Moment of truth. I ain't scared, you, you seem scared. Are we gonna get an axle or an old truck? Did it look stuck like it's buried in the mud? I don't really, no, I mean, not really. It's pretty flat, slant. And it's moving already. Oh, it is? Oh yeah, there ain't like, there ain't nothing stopping it. All right, well, I'm gonna get down there and uh, well, let's go ahead and put this on. Safety first. So we did get these. Um, don't look at the sponsor, because it's not a sponsor. Just for our safety, you know. It's a winch. A winch cover. Plus it's like putting rocks in that thing or something. And that way if it snaps the line will just fall down. Somebody's gonna call us out on that and be like, dude, you gotta put weights in it. There's weights in there, there's plenty of weights. There's plenty of weights. It's lead weight. Feels like it's coming out like really smooth, so no obstructions, it's not hung up. Yeah. Probably the easiest pull ever. Think so? It's the hardest to find the truck. <laughs> yeah, car, you can already see the top coming out. There, you can see it. There's an old truck in the water out here. Commerce, Georgia. That thing is, uh, that thing's seen better days. Woo! This is the best part. <laughs> Watching it come out like this. I thought it was a full-size truck, but now I'm thinking it's something else. I think that roof was missing on purpose. It might be an old Bronco. Dude, is that an old Bronco? I couldn't, you could tell why I couldn't tell what it was. I thought it was a Bronco at first, but I think it's just You got me excited. <laughs> I think it's just a Ranger. But yeah, like the, the roof almost looks like it, it was meant to be cut off. But yeah, oh gosh, now I see what you're talking about. It is rusty. Yeah, skin. it's gone, man. All right, well, you're gonna have to get back in there a little bit and find that chain to hook oh, this onto. Am I? Yeah. Yeah, bro. Come on, this tight. <laughs> tight like a tiger. might still not be enough. That thing is pretty old. Dude, this... I, <laughs> I'm kind of impressed. <laughs> Look at that. Man. Yeah, I can't believe it held up, man. The wheels are still turning. Yeah, they're... What? God, there's no engine in it? There's, a, there's an engine. Is there? Golly, that thing's been in there forever. I hear flopping noises inside. There's some fish. Dude, look at the hubcaps on this thing. This is an old truck. Oh, there's a, yeah, there's an engine. It's pretty open. Dude, what? I mean, this is a lot older than I thought. I mean, it's a pretty small engine for like a big room, right? There's a lot of extra room, yeah. The front looks cool though. Yeah, this is old. Very boxy. And... What's going on in there? There's some fish in there. Jesus, Trying to make their way out. Are they big? Semi. Man. You hungry? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at them. Look at them go. Well, let's pull it up a little bit more, or let's get it out of the water at least. And then we'll see what we're looking at. All right. What we got here, Jeremy? Got lots of fish in there. <laughs> lots, of, lots of fish in them waters. Don't get too close, they're gonna, they're gonna splash me. Yeah, I don't know how well you guys can see, but there's lots of fish. We're gonna free these little I buddies. Get the door open. <laughs> God, the roof is gone. There's some big ones in there, man. 
I mean, big enough for you, not me. The hubcaps still on here. I don't know. It's missing one. There's like three hubcaps. It's just a really old Ford pickup. Yeah. That motor looks like it's barely in there. It's a lot older than I thought. I mean, the the, the front end is like, it's just I don't know. It's a really old truck. Yeah, what do you guys think in the comments? Let us know. Oh yeah, I don't know how to get the door. So reach in there, man. I gotta reach as our pole. You crazy? <laughs> put some, put some snake in there. Put some gloves on. Why? What's up with catfish like it? Ain't, ain't nothing else in there. What is it? Just a bluegill back there. We need we need a crowbar. You know that? <laughs> like the whole sides coming off. Should we just go for it? Uh no, <laughs> try, we'll try the other door maybe. Get all the water out of it at least. Oh yeah. Okay, it's gonna kill all the fish. We should have pulled out some with our hands. What are you doing in there, man? I'm trying to catch these fish. You can't get the dang door open. They won't stop moving around. We gotta save as many as we can. Trying. It's a big one over there. Over here. Over here, big fish. What is that part of the uh big part of the roof probably? There may be some casualties, but we're we're gonna try. Yeah, there probably some ca casualties of war. Good job, I'm proud of you. Doing good things. I'm trying to. <laughs> I don't know if we can save them all though. I'm gonna have to drag it up to the top. Get the door open. You got this, man. It's holding on by a thread. Maybe if we, if we both pull. I think that's why I call them mud cats. Let's keep falling out. God dang, it's hell like right there. Man, the fishes keep coming. Yeah, yeah I mean, any more, the door's about to just fall off. And just like that, truck is coming out after it's the tag says 87, so it's been a while. What's the math on that? 30 years? Something like that. Don't quote me. Pretty crazy, the wheel's still turning. It always helps to have the axles actually turn. All right, we're almost done. We got the wrecker repositioned because we're going to try and pry this door open. I'm excited we got this thing out. I mean, as far as identifying it, yeah, we're going to see if there's a vent. On the plate, the only part of the plate is the year. It says 87. So expired in 87. When were you born? A little bit. I don't know. Yeah, 93. <laughs> Man, this thing was, this thing might have been dumped before he's even born. Possibly. Look at you. Since birth, he was destined to pull this car out. I guess so, man. That's awesome. It's weird how that happens. Isn't it weird? It's, it was fate. So let's pry this open and see what happens. Just like that, huh? Let me get out of the way first. <laughs> I was wrong. There goes the door. We just opened it. Look at that. Now to see if there's a, a VIN number on this 30 whatever year old truck. <laughs> I, I mean, they're, that, they're actually, just, is, that, is that it? Yeah, dude, I think it is. I think, I think that's it. It's, yeah, pull it off, let's put that over here. I got some brushes, I think. 
Oh my gosh, dude, it is. How lucky is that? It's not luck. Skill. It's skill. It's a skill. What am I saying? Golly. Look at this fish. I, I don't have hands. Let's we'll put it on the tow truck. OK, put it on the tow truck. I'm going to go fishing. See if you can clean this off. Dang, there's a lot of fish in here. So far away. Yeah, I don't think you're going to make that. Uh, I think it's two at a time. <laughs> You're, I, I'm proud of you, man. You're doing good things. I'm trying. You're gonna go somewhere when you grow up. I'm gonna go fishing. <laughs> I mean, that's what we're looking at. There she is. So, I mean, that's what we're working with. We just need a little bit of water. I probably gotta go over to the uh, to the water there and rinse it off a little better. But she's there. Go. You can see the VIN and everything, huh? Mm -hmm. It's an older VIN. The fifth generation Ford F-Series was a line of pickup trucks produced from 1967 to 72 with sharper styling lines, larger cab, and expanded engine options. This generation of truck is a piece of Americana and perhaps most notably used in the 2007 movie No Country for Old Men. What is it that your niece is about? We pulled a car out of the lake. That's kind of what we do for a living and we wanted to report it and turn over the, because we found a, a VIN number. It's a very old car, but we did find a VIN number, so we basically just wanted to report it and then see what he wanted to do with it, you know, possibly get a flatbed out here to tow it away. Yeah, obviously we didn't find a tag, but there's a part of it that says 87 expired, and we got the, the VIN plate off of it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you, somehow, I'm surprised we got it right here. It's like an old version. Perfect. You know, Oh, yeah, we're one of them. We, you know, we document. Searching for missing people, pulling them out. What's the story with this one? Nothing. Good question. Nothing. We don't have it. I was hoping y'all could tell us. Y'all just decided to come out here and look? Yeah, we, we, we were searching for another missing person um, in Athens, and we were just checking all the waterways, and we found this vehicle. And We also do cleanups, you know, try to get stuff out of the water when we can. Yeah, that's like we've been in a while. I know. <laughs> yeah, it was full of fish. We had to clean up all the fish and put them back. What's there really? Yeah, there's, yeah. Catfish right there. there's still some. You should have seen how many were there before we cleaned it. Yeah, there's a casualty here too. We got, I, I probably, at least 20 fish we took out of there. The 20 catfish. catfish. still alive. Yeah, catfish is still kicking there. You want to grab them and throw them back. The hell, they may want it. I bet he'll take it. Well, he's watching me. He's like, man, there are a lot of fish in there. Yeah, he didn't seem too interested. Nah, he don't want no mud cat. It might taste a little, uh, metallic <laughs> I found those on the ground just throwing oh, here. I was like, man, them, them look clean compared to the rest of it. Right. Yeah, yeah that corner of that plate, it looks like 87. Yeah. That's all that was on there, though. Most of the time, they don't even have plates. Yeah. It's got the caps on that. Yeah. It's got like three of them. Yeah, these two are... Or the other one on the front left is different than these two. Huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, the cat right there. That's see if he wants that fish, Logan. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you want this catfish? <laughs> oh, that thing got it. He's still alive. You see, I'm going to my options here. <laughs> Leave empty handed. <laughs> I'd be surprised if that thing came back to any of them. Yeah. Just Let's never know. I mean, but. Was this an ancient cold case? I'm saying there's one right there still alive if you want to take it home. Oh, yeah, it is right there, isn't it? Right there in the middle, there's two of them. There's one here and there's one over there at that door. That one looks. Actually, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that one looks. He is moving. There's another one right there. You can have them. Okay. <laughs> Anthony's going to take that one with him. You want to take them? I'll put that in. Yeah. Are you serious? <laughs> I don't care. If you want. Call the NR. <laughs> Let him fin you. <laughs> there is. There's another one right there if you can get to it. I don't know. It's in the, uh... I'm not getting my uniform. Now, there's a pile of people out here when we was doing this. And not one of them even. They, they didn't give a damn. I was like, God, y'all know this is out here? <laughs> I mean, right there in the middle. Banks County. Nothing surprises people here. Either. No, they didn't, even, they didn't even care. Not yeah, one person yeah. walked up and asked any questions. Yeah, they like, whatever. Not, I don't know if I can get that one. <laughs> Probably have to break right, it. Cool. <laughs> What's up? There he is. 
make sure you get pictures. I forgot to take pictures. <laughs> Who? Boss. There's your, there's your snack. <laughs> Fish having a bad day. Uh huh. <laughs> 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 there any bass in front of you? I didn't Nothing. see any. No, uh, just blue, bluegill and catfish. Apparently there are some large crappy in here. Well, we got here earlier, there's people lining out there. They're just pulling fish out, lifting around. Like, man, just filling up a bucket and leaving. Like, damn, it'll be good eating. I'll have a tow company, y'all want to come get it. Usually, I mean, we don't have anybody in mind. Usually, like, the, the police would call somebody in rotation. And then if by chance you guys didn't want to deal with it, then we'd just start making phone calls to see if somebody wanted to haul it off for us. No, we can always call next to us. Yeah, if you don't mind, it'd be easier than us. I mean, usually we'll, just, we'll call somebody and offer pre advertising or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Has this happened before? This is my any, first time. Any reports? It might have happened in the past, but not yeah. since I've been here. Because there's not really any other boat ramps in the area, right? This is pretty much it. Yeah. This is no return on the them. No, I don't know, Georgia. They haven't said anything. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's probably been a while since it was registered, so we're probably not going to get it registered. Yeah. They found something that said 87. Yeah, on the, the corner of the tag says 87 expired. All right, the tow company's here. Let's see the man work. Shit, I got a warrant on me. They showed you as a female for some reason in the system. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You got something to say? <laughs> well, <laughs> how long have you been? Know? How long have you been? Know? The cat's out of the bag now. <laughs> how long have you been know? here? <laughs> I, 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 I ain't known him long enough. <laughs> some I need to talk to you about. I ain't gonna lie, it hit me nervous as <laughs> shit. I was like, oh shit, is there something coming back? I didn't do anything. I don't think I did. Dude. I think what they did was run it out of South Carolina, so it came back to a South Carolina female for some reason. <laughs> Tell Candace, I'm like, something I gotta talk to you about. I'm the best looking woman around. Yes. That ain't funny. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Is it? <laughs> Number 10 in the books. No, we hit double digits, can you believe it? it was, I, I thought we, we saved like 30 fish. We did, we, <laughs> sa we saved lives today. Fish lives. Fish lives, fish lives matter. Yeah, so. I guess so. <laughs> Dude, that one fisherman even uh, took two of the catfish. That was the strangest thing I've ever seen. I don't know if that's on video or not, but this guy, this, this guy came by, this local. He wasn't, he, was, he just he just picked up two catfish and left. I was like, what <laughs> like, is that about? I wouldn't eat them, but hey, you know. I mean, I don't think he's get much out. I don't know what, he, you know what? Two each is on. Yeah, so. But. Now the, we got, uh, now we got, got final 11. We got final 11, well we know where 11, 12, and 13 are. Mmm, that's right, we do, we just gotta go back. I don't know if that's next or not. It might be. We'll see. We'll just have to see. But, we haven't really talked about uh, the tow truck yet. Obviously it worked. I replaced the four hydraulic lines, gave it an oil change, and uh, she seems to be running. So hopefully that lasts that. longer. We are, long term goal, raising money for a new tow truck. Uh, if you're interested in that, there's a GoFundMe link below. That's just a way to support us. That We don't expect that to happen overnight. But no, but I mean, it'd be a cool upgrade. Anything helps. We gotta start at the bottom, so yeah. we got when it runs. But it I, I mean, she's good, as long as you know she drives, but. Yeah, I mean, she, she made it here. Yeah. As long as they're as easy as this one. Nah, we need a challenge. <laughs> we need to find a rocky challenge. A rocky challenge. Rocky. But I'm starving. Yeah. I think we should go to Applebee's. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Make sure to subscribe, like, comment, and we're gonna have a clean out video if you haven't watched that in the link in the description below, going more in depth into that truck. Yeah. And uh, yeah. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Okay. Later. Bye.